Tuache mambo ya ubaguzi. Wakulima wa mpunga wanatazamia kuimarisha kilimo hicho kufuatia kukamilika kwa ujenzi wa bwawa la Thiba ikitazamiwa kuongeza maradufu uzalishaji wa mchele kutoka tani 1114 kwa sasa hadi tani 200. Bwawa hilo linatarajiwa kujaa maji kutokana na mvua inayotarajiwa mwezi huu. Ona habari wa KT News Moige William alizuru mradi huu na kuandaa taarifa ifuatayo. Ujenzi wa bwawa la Thiba ambalo ni miongoni mwa miradi mikuu ya Rais Uhuru Kenyatta eneo la Mlima Kenya umekamilika. Ujenzi wa bwawa hili umegharimu shilingi bilioni 8.2 na linalenga kukabiliana na uhaba wa maji katika mradi wa unyunyuziaji maji wa Mwea katika kaunti ya Kirinyaga. Kuhifadhi maji kwa ajili ya unyunyuziaji maji mashamba, bwawa hilo linatarajiwa kusaidia uzalishaji zaidi wa mchele. This project I want to say and confirm is that uh, we are storing flood water in Mwea, or rather in Thiba, Thiba River, and now we are just waiting for the, for the start of the rains. Any time from today, if the rains commence, we'll be able to start harvesting water here. And uh, according to our projections, it will take about two to three months for this water to completely fill, and we start spilling the water through the spillway. Bwawa hili linalenga kuongeza kiasi cha ekari 10000 pamoja na ekari 1025 inayotumika kwa sasa. Because you find that when there are rains there are a lot of water when it comes to the dry season the rice farmers downstream at the at my irrigation scheme always suffer from the shortage of water. So with the badam coming in it will stabilize the river flow. That means the farmers who are farming downstream especially at Mwea irrigation scheme will be able to have continuous water throughout the, throughout the year they will be able to irrigate the whole year bwawa hili litawezesha wakulima wa mpunga kuzalisha mchele kwa misimu miwili kwa mwaka kutokana na kuwepo kwa maji ya kutosha when we look at what we are producing today in Mwea is 114 metric tons 1000 metric tons of, of rice the national requirement is projected or estimated around 480000 In Mwea we are going to increase this with this dam completion of this project to 200,000 metric tons. So that is how this project will impact in terms of going a journey towards fulfilling or cutting the deficit of rice in the country. Rais Uhuru Kenyatta alizindua mradi huo mnamo Novemba mwaka 2017 ambao ulikuwa miongoni mwa miradi yake ya kwanza baada ya kuchaguliwa kwa awamu ya pili. Ujenzi ulianza mwezi wa Machi mwaka 2018. Mamlaka ya kitaifa ya unyunyuziaji maji mashamba pia inaendelea na shughuli za upanuzi katika sehemu zingine kuna kukuzwa mpunga. Moige William KTN News. Na mtazamaji taarifa hiyo ya Moige inatufikisha katika tamati ya taarifa zetu za dira ya wiki. Shukrani sana kwa kutazama taarifa zetu tangu tulipoanza. Uh, nasema asante